Hi, this is Sai Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forex pisami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpisami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Now guys, as usual, let's take a look at the gold market. So based on the action that we see right now, it's not much to comment. Since since the beginning of the week, as you can see, market stands in very tight range, right below the broken confidence support and below the monthly pivot support line. So um, right now, guys, it's too many inputs that could make an impact on the gold market behavior. So first of all, this is the Fed statement that will be uh, in the evening today. Also, today is the elections in the Netherlands Parliament, so it also could make an impact, especially if uh, ultra-right forces will take uh, the lead there. So, currently, it's, uh, the public poll opinion shows that it's not really very probable, but very often happens that the mass media uh, brings the not really uh, correct information. So uh, the same was approximately in the United States election when the all newspapers and the uh, internet uh, resources shows that uh, Hillary Clinton should take the leg and, and uh, become the president, but this hasn't happened. So the same could happen there as well. So uh, that's why we also will keep a close eye on what is going on in the Netherlands. So right now we see the very interesting process in the European Union. Partially, we have discussed this in our weekly researches. So, speaking shortly, we see that right now the process of starting on the new European Union has started. And it should be completed approximately to the 2020 year. Uh, it is interesting that precisely to this term, all major European Union countries, I mean the Germany, France, should repatriate they all go back to their storages from the overseas storages right now. And we think that the, the European Union shape will change. So all Eastern European countries will be, uh, so how to better to say it, will be, will exit out from the European Union. So because these processes that now are going there shows that uh, all members do not need them anymore. So, and probably we, th we think that this will be some reconstruction of the European Union. This has started from the Great Britain already, and that will be continued with the old core that was before extension of the European Union in the 90s. So, um, that's what we will see here. That's why the elections in the major countries, in Germany and France and the Netherlands today, so be not just simple elections as usual, but they could really get long far going consequences. That's why we should keep a close eye. That's another input on the gold market and it definitely could impact on it. That's why uh, it's very difficult to predict what will happen even tomorrow. But right now, based on the technical picture that we have, uh, we probably could continue to watch for this setup that we have discussed already. So we think that, at least by the technical picture right now, this gold market could show another leg to the downside and reach the 1180, 1175 area. And uh, on the intraday charts, this could take the shape of the butterfly, as it stands right here. At least currently, guys, we do not need any reasons to be hurry up, to hurry up with any decision making and taking position. Because if the scenario will be completed, we will use it. If not, we will take a look what we will get. Because by our opinion, gold still stands in the right now in the, some process of the reversal to the bullish trend. It could be it could be a bit long term. The process of this reversal it could be really volatile, but the ongoing processes that right now stands on the mar in, on the market in the global policy makes us think that uh, the tension degree is really increased significantly, and this will be mostly supportive for the gold market. So that's why uh, if we will get this technical stop as we have plotted here, so this butterfly will be completed. We could think about taking the long position on the gold market because after that, some significant retracement could start in the gold market. 
So that's what binary around vehicle pivot support runs, powerful completion point in 1180 lows. So that's what we'll be watching for in today's session. Um, until that will happen and until the situation will be resolved, I think it's not necessary to take any position at all right at the eve of important events, as the, such as the Fed statement, such as the results of the elections in the Netherlands. So let's see what we will get.